card opening i'm doing a challenge this time so i've ordered cards from ebay because i really like the dust on cards i really want a white dust on so there's two different like packs here so let's go with the first one right now all right guys first we're gonna open the white dust on pack So let's open it. So first we got a blue dust on. Water attribute. Another blue dust on. <gasps> green dust on. Another green dust on. Oh my this is a this is a right. This is what these dust on cards are supposed to do. You're supposed to transport them to the enemy's field. So this is I think this is the spell for that. Let me read what it says. When this card is face up on the field, on the field, is destroyed by other opponent's card, either by battle, and it was face up at the start of the damage step, or by a card effect, and sent to the graveyard, you can special summon any dust or monster of your choice from your hand or deck to anywhere on the field but you must special summon an equal number of monsters on each side so this is the card i think there's two but this is the main one hi eli so this card is the point of these dust stones because you might know but dust stones cannot be tributed so there's no way to get them off your field if you have one yep So then we got one red dust on, which is pretty cool, and the almighty of star dust on. Pretty cool, I would say. Let me read what he is. Cannot be normal summon set, must be special summon from your hand by sending any number of dust on monsters you control to the graveyard and cannot be special summoned by other ways. This card attack and defense become the equal number of monsters sent to the graveyard for its summon times a thousand your opponent cannot flip or special summon any monsters or activate any set spell trap card on the field if you control more monsters than your opponent this does destroy this card so this is pretty good. So let's open this second pack. Oh, white dust on the one I actually wanted. Let's see what I get off this one. So first we start with a white dust on. This is actually probably the only dust on that you should have on your side of the field. Okay. Because, right, so you know when you're using house dust on the smartest thing to do is summon a red dust on on your opponent's side of the field and a white dust on on your side of the field because these guys can be tributed and you have no recoil you like because the red dust on if if it dies you take damage the blue dust on it like it's one of those deck destroyer effects so here we've got a yellow dust on I'm going to read the yellow and green dust ons because I've got two yellow dust on and I've never I don't have I've never had the yellow or green dust on in uh dual links. So there we got this Magicalized Dust on. There's some orange dust on there as well. Uh you you can only control one magicalized dust on mop the quick monster cannot be tributed or be used as a fusion synchro sees material for a summon 
When this card you control is destroyed by an opponent's card effect and sent to the graveyard, you can add a dust or monster from your deck to your hand. So this is really good. I can see a red, orange, green, blue, purple, brown, dark green, white, black, light purple, and the yellow dust on, on this. So we got two of these. And one of the rare ones, like the really good, I've got the two like good cards here right now. So I've got two diamond dust on. So when this card on the field is destroyed by battle or a card effect, special summon a dust on monster from your deck to anywhere on the field equal to the number of those destroyed cards. If this card is in your graveyard you can banish one dust on monster from your graveyard and special summon this card in defense position as a normal monster fiend type dark level one attack zero defense a thousand to your opponent's field this card cannot be treated as a trap this effect can only be used while this card is in the graveyard, if summoned this way, it cannot be attributed or be used as material for fusion synchro at sea summon. So this is another one. So the entire point of the dust on deck is to troll your opponent. <laughs> so they have no space on the field. All they have is these guys that they can't get rid of. The only way to get rid of them is when I damage, I destroy them myself. Which I'll only do when I have like my strongest monsters so they won't be able to do anything. <laughs> so then we got uh, one of the most famous Dust On cards, Dust On Roller. It's very famous in the Dust On category stuff. So I can see the dark green Dust On, the red Dust On, the blue Dust On, the yellow Dust On, the orange Dust On, the normal green Dust On and the best one the white dust on so i got two of these target one monster on the field this turn it cannot be tributed or be fusion sees material for a summon if you set this card and control it destroy your opponent's card effect and set to the graveyard add a dust on monster from your deck to your hand so you know my cybernetic deck I'm going to add some of these cards, mainly my G, White Dust On, my second favourite card ever after Cyber Dragon Dwee, Dwee. <laughs> so I'm going to add these cards so they can have like the ultimate combo thing, let's see how many cards I've got in total though, 2, 4, 6, Eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen 12, 14, 15, 16, 17 cards from that, that eBay pack, which is pretty good. That was a pretty good pack for me because I like the dust ons and I really wanted a white dust on. Because if they just gave me the dust ons, that would be bad. Dust stones are only useful when you have these, the traps and spells for them. Okay guys, so that was fun. I'll do another card opening soon and it will be a surprise shocker for what card it's going to be. But until next time.